first date we had would have been 27th of December 1952. So in actual fact, in next month we'll be 57 years married. That with Mona's poor eyesight, that uh, the chances are she wasn't able to do her own makeup. One eye doesn't work and the other one is only at half yeah. power. So if Mona needed something, I would do it. Less is more, so I don't want anything that looks as if there's makeup on. You know, I just wanted to make Mona feel good. I love the idea of getting up and getting my face done and be ready to face the world. I absolutely love it. Oh, I'm in heaven. I could sit here now for the rest of the day. <laughs> Mona and I are going out on a date tonight, and I just picked number two. So I'm using that all the time now. I thought it was a perfect match. This would be a, a paparazzi look. It's very easy to conceal more here, perfect. The skin looks flawless. Even Michelangelo would be jealous. But one thing I am conscious of over the last few years is how often we meet up with people where you have a couple and they're looking after one another. Still looking out late into life, they're still looking after one another. Thank you very much, everybody. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed the show.